Introducing the race cam. This is a product we've developed uh, for race car drivers to have a camera in car uh, with a little more control as far as up, down, tilt, side to side turning uh, to give you some better shots other than just pointed at one location. Uh, I'm going to take a few minutes to go over all the features. Um, I would like to note it runs on between 7 and 17 volts. Um, it will be set up to plug in any 12 volt power source and it's completely standalone. Uh, now let's check out the features. I'm going to turn on the transmitter. Okay, I'll just instantly you can see that the camera tilted down because of where the throttle stick position is at. Uh, that's required when you turn the radio on. Okay, so let's look at the pan feature. As I said before, this is a full 360 rotation continuous in either direction, so you don't need to worry about any wiring. Okay, now mounted in this position, you can tilt the camera down 45 degrees or tilt it up 90 degrees. Now, this whole unit can be mounted upside down and have the exact same functions and it'll point 90 down and 45 up, uh, which is really versatile for mounting options in the car. Um, let's go ahead and turn the camera on. Okay, now if you watch the little video screen, we can see the live video. All right, and you can see it's moving around with me. Okay, now if we want to look here closer, up here in the corner, you can see the little record. I'm going to push the record button, and then I'll change to red, which means the camera's now recording. And then again, now I've stopped the recording. Now I've set this up to have full control over all the functions in the camera. So by using this switch, we can go to camera mode. We can go to multi-picture mode. We can go to time-lapse mode. We can go into the settings menu. We can go to the playback menu. Okay, and then back to record. Now, in combination of both switches, we can get into all the different menus. Okay. Settings. Now, you have to hold this button down to stay in the settings. And then you can use this button to scroll through wherever you want to change things. When you're done, let off the button, it goes back to the home screen. Okay, same thing here. Camera, I can take a picture. Okay, I can go to multiple pictures. I can take a picture. Takes time to process. And we're done. All right, and then obviously we can go into time lapse and do the same thing. Okay, and I showed you the settings. We can also go back to playback. All right, now I can scroll through what's on the card. And we can look at live playback. Okay, so we can exit out of that. Go back to the menu. Okay. And exit. And we're back to the main camera again. So, like I say, this developed for race car drivers to have a little more perspective. This can be controlled by somebody in the pits. Um, obviously this screen is a little small but it can be upgraded with a bigger view screen um, I can build them with any radio you like uh, there's a lot of options uh, so if you're interested 
give it a look, uh, give me a call. Thanks.